I don't really get along. Well, not get along, but I don't really make a uh, long-term friend with many, many people because I feel that most people are kind of disingenuous. At least the ones that I've met in my life, which can, which is a little sad to be honest. But um, there is definitely a big reason as to why Millie's like one of my long-term, long-term friends. It's it's incredibly hard to find somebody like Millie, so... Um, as much as you guys see how, you know, chaotic and gremlin she can be, there is a whole different side to her that you guys have no idea. Um, and honestly, like, when if she ever, like, shows it, um, it's honestly a privilege because it's this is as real as it gets. I'm, I'm telling you guys now, this is actually the realest person that you can meet. In your life, well, that would so make me cry. <laughs> don't fucking cry. <laughs> I think people don't give you enough credit. Like they always see you as a chaotic gremlin and stuff, and it, it is true. But that's all, honestly like not even half of you. So you really need to start acknowledging like the other side of you, the, the side that's actually genuine that most people don't even like have. <laughs> I think maybe I'm biased, but you know, I just feel like. Out of all the people I've met in my life, there's really, really nobody like you. <laughs> oh, you're gonna make me cry! Yeah, yeah, it's it's the same as me. What are we going on Tete now? I mean, like, I'm pretty sure we've been friends for a long time for a reason because, like, you're very patient with me, and I really, really appreciate the the things that you do for me as a friend. Fuck you! I swear to God, every, every single time you talk about you makes me cry because I'm really, really happy that. You you're my friend. And, you know, there's a lot of friends that we have that we gave up on us or kind of left. But we're still together, and, you know, I'm, I'm happy that. <laughs> I'm happy that even though I don't have a lot of friends, I don't mind because I have you. <laughs> That's it. You almost got me. <laughs> Don't make me cry. Whenever I talk about N, I always cry. <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm holding like, a eulogy every cry time. Either, you know? <laughs> Don't. I, it, like, it, it will go really bad if I have to be the stronger one because if we both, if I start crying, yeah. then then it like goes back to Millie. Millie cries even more, so I cannot <sighs> cry. She, uh, I think the only time that Anna, she never cries, like, Anna is more like, um, she's the type of person who would never cry in front of anyone, but she would cry by herself alone. So sometimes, because, like, she always prioritizes people, even before her. I don't know if you guys know that, but she always does. She always, whenever something's wrong, she always makes sure that, um, she makes sure that her friends are okay before her. And sometimes, I kind of get like a bit worried if she's doing her here or not because there are things that she would like to keep her problems to herself. And so, I just want you to know that if you ever need someone to talk to, I'm always here for you. And please focus on yourself. <laughs> and uh, you've you've given enough. You've given enough love to the people around you. So always, always try to um, prioritize yourself for once. That's all. <laughs>